What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. My name's Nick. My name's Nathan. And this is Full Throttle Cars. Today we are here at Easton for the Triple F Collection Mercedes-Benz of Easton Car Show. We're gonna break this up into two videos. The first is gonna be the actual show. The second is going to be in the parking lots because we've already went through the parking lots. There's some pretty amazing cars just in the parking lots and along the streets. But with that said, we're gonna jump into the show. Check out this old Ferrari right over there, guys. I'm not an expert when it comes to classic Ferraris, but if you know what that is, let me know down in the comments section. We got a 488 coming in right behind it as well. We'll stand over here and get these things when they're leaving. Alright guys, we got a nice GT3 right here, really neat blue color. Take a quick walk around to manual. Alright guys, we got a gray Huracan here, lots of forged carbon. We've seen this one before. We'll just take take a walk right down this line here. Got the HRE wheels, forged carbon side skirts, big wing on the back. We got another stock Huracan here. This one does not have the clear engine cover, can't see in the engine bay. We got a Perfamonte here. Check out this carbon fiber wing. Center lock wheels. The big carbon ceramic brakes. All right guys, we have the green SVJ right here, SVJ Roadster. We've seen this car a couple of different times. Take a quick walk around, take a peek in the interior. All right, guys, we got a 918 right there. We're staying on the outside of the line right now. We will get in there eventually. We got the Paganis over there. All right, guys, after a long time in line, over an hour, we are almost to half play to go inside. But we are on the inside now. We can take a look. We got the nice Ferrari F40 right here in front of us. Got the blue GT over there by the Koenigsegg Regera. We'll check back in later once we get inside. All right, guys, so we're still outside of this loop right here, but we're right behind one of the McLaren Sabres. There's two in here. Just want you to look into the back end of that thing. It's got a ginormous wing. Just looks awesome in that orange color. It's just a ton of carbon fiber. Crazy vehicle to see. There are only being 15 of those in the world. All right, guys, we finally made it inside. We've got the Triple F Collection Pagani Lyra BC Makina Volante, one of 25 in the world. We take a quick walk around this, and we'll go check out the other Paganis. There are actually seven or six Pagani Lyras here out of the only 100 ever made. So we really need 6% of them are here right now in Columbus, Ohio. All right, guys, we got a couple more Paganis over here. We got another Lyra right here. 
Then right beside it, we have a Zonda, the only Zonda here at the show. We'll take a walk around each other. All right, guys, we've got the one of six Koenigsegg Aguera XS right here. We'll take a walk around and take a look at it. Finish in a very nice red color, lots of carbon fiber all over it. Carbon wheels. You take a look at the, uh, the ghost emblem in the middle there. You can actually look inside and see some of the suspension elements. Lots and lots of carbon fiber. Very rare, very valuable, very awesome to see here in Columbus. All right, guys, so we got this red Ferrari SF90 right here just shining in the sunlight. We can take a quick walk around this thing. Look at the headlights on that, just beautiful. And you do have a little bit of that yellow that goes along with the Ferrari logo right there. And if you want to look inside, there's red accents on the inside, and then it's mostly black. It looks pretty beautiful. Not that much carbon fiber on this thing, but that doesn't matter because the Ferrari looks best in red. Everybody will agree with that. All right, guys, so next up we have the Ferrari La Ferrari, one of 499 in the world. And there are actually two of these here today. Check out this black car with the red accents and then some of the carbon fiber on the front bumper right there. You can take a quick walk around. There's carbon fiber. Oh. There's carbon fiber all over these side view mirrors. Walking back around it, you can actually take a look inside the engine bay and see that beautiful Ferrari engine. All right, guys, here is another one of the Pagani wires here. We'll take another walk around. This one is mostly black carbon fiber, but we do have some white accents, a really neat little touch here. The little Italian flag colors there on the mirror cap. Let's take a quick walk around here. And while we're over here, we'll take a look at the McLaren Saber, one of uh, 15 in the world, and there are two here as well. So we are in some very good company here in Columbus. Lots of rare cars, lots of valuable cars. This is actually a really neat spec, kind of similar to the Triple F Collection McLaren Senna. All right, guys, here's the Triple F Collection Koenigsegg Regera. We actually just saw this, I believe, two weeks ago for the first time over at the meet in Whitehall. We can just take a little quick walk around it and check out some of the bits. All white with some carbon accents. Really neat carbon fiber wheels you can take a look at. Then right beside it, we've got the Bugatti Chiron from the Triple F collection. We haven't seen, actually we did just see this one as well uh, two weeks ago. You can check out the W16 in the engine bay back there. All right, guys, so right here we have three crazy McLarens owned by the Triple F Auto Collection. So first we have one of 500 McLaren Senna's right here. This beautiful carbon fiber and orange color. We've seen this. It is just dazzling. Now over, if we take a look to the right, we have the McLaren Speedtail. There are only 106 of these. All right, guys, right here we've got the McLaren Elva. We could not get a video of it while we were inside but is one of 149, I believe. Very interesting car, no front windshield. Once that guy moves, you can see that a little bit better. Very rare and valuable car. All right, guys, we got a couple of Ventador SVs. We'll take a look around here. This one we saw a couple meets ago. What are they called again? Center lockup. Got a yellow one. We got a really neat blue one over there we'll go take a look at. I'd say this blue SV here is my favorite one of the four. All right, guys, we got a couple 720Ss here, one in silver and one in this really neat blue color, kind of similar to the Aventador SV of earlier. 
lots of carbon fiber down these side areas. And we got a row of GTRs right here. This one is in a gold wrap, big wing on the back. It definitely, definitely looks like something you'd see in Dubai. Going over here, we'll check out this R32 Skyline generation. <laughs> got a red GTR, then we got a white Nismo right here. A couple Lotus Evoras as well. Coming over here, we got some more American cars. We got a couple C8s, some Mustangs. There's also a blue GT back there we'll take a look at. Then we got the C7 ZR1. Lots of carbon fiber in the engine bay. Of course, the big carbon bit right that comes through the hood. Carbon fiber roof in the back. We got the blue C8 with the high wing. Some GT500s back here. Then we got a blue Ford GT. All right, guys, so looking at the front of this blue 4GT right here, you can see these insane looking front headlights. Those just look so cool. And then this blue with white stripes just looks so mean and so fun at the same time. We got a 992 Turbo S pulling out as well as a Cayman. All right, guys, here over more towards the dealership. We've got two 488 pieces. We'll take a quick walk around. This one here in blue. Yellow brake calipers. Take a peek at the engine. Then we go down to this other one here. We've got gray or silver and red spec. I don't know if you can see in there on the steering wheel, the bottom of the steering wheel, you got the Italian flag colors on the carbon fiber. Really neat spec. All right, guys, so that is going to do it for our video today. I hope you guys enjoyed. There was some absolutely insane cars, stuff that would rival events in Southern California. Really very few other places in the United States are we going to ever see cars like this all in one place. So if you did enjoy, be sure go down, drop a like, and subscribe. Share the channel. Help us to hit 5,000 subscribers. And with that, we'll see you in the next video. Bye, guys.